was simply the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences for many years after the University of Guam became a land-grant institution in 1972. And for many years, the university grew with the program until 2004, when then-president Dr. Howard Allen restructured UOG. He took the old College of Agriculture and the, uh, he split up the College of Arts and Sciences, took the science and the old College of Agriculture and put them together and called it the College of Natural and Applied Sciences. So um, I basically have been the first dean of this new college since 2004. That's Dr. Lee Yudin, who is still the dean of the College of Natural and Applied Sciences, or CNAS for short. The old agriculture focus remains an essential program that helps feed our people. And with several other programs, from biology to computer science, it's proof the college has evolved and diversified. Take the biomed track, for example. As we've talked about how well the nursing program is done, and the nursing program students have to take three or four of, of the classes that we offer in CNAS. But the, 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 the pre-med, the, the biomed majors, are doing remarkable work, not only when they're here as undergraduates, but they're getting into medical schools throughout the United States, vet schools, um, uh, dental schools, pharmacy schools. So these are really talented young STEM majors that are doing extremely well. This August, CNAS will launch a new venture, the first cohort of its computer science degree bridge program with the Guam Community College. Students can start at GCC for their first two years and transfer all their credits to complete their degree at UOG. Yudin calls it a plus plus. It's another avenue to churn out more graduates, many of who also choose to stay on Guam and contribute in good jobs. I think what we're producing is um, uh, a group of individuals that um, this society and, and the culture of Guam can be extremely proud of. And I'm proud of all my graduates. You can learn more about the diverse CNAS offerings and its outreach components at this year's virtual UOG Charter Day celebration themed, Transforming Lives, Advancing Communities. So we're highlighting um, beekeeping. We're highlighting what agriculture is all about. We're highlighting how to deal with um, uh, uh, food inequities. We're uh, uh, dealing with almost every aspect that will try to improve the lives of our community. So I invite everybody to come online to be able to, to see all the presentations that we have next week. Um, in the years past, as you know, our courtyard was filled with thousands of people that were able to go from one canopy to the other. Well, this year the canopy is going to be on the, on, the, on, the, on the virtual Zoom. So it'll be a little different, but we're still going to showcase exactly what this college is all about. Reporting for Guam's News Network, this is Lacey Martinez. Thank you.